Hi, TJ Goshes here, Social System Elite, and I want to show you the most recent updates to the software and what they do. So, firstly, we've got the username and password for proxies. Not all proxies require them, but if you have a username and password that you need to use with your proxies, click on this button right here and insert your username and password. Click OK or the X and it will use those proxies as needed. The next thing we've done is underneath the attachment for media, image or video, select it here. You can remove it by clicking this button. The other thing is the click image uh, links. So for instance, if I put in a link here to my website, one of my sites, and I put in a post, batch quantity, set my wait times here, select a group to use. I know the first couple in this was actually bad links, so I'm going to go ahead and remove those real quick. And just test run this so you can see how it works. Oh, I didn't set a project name. So it's going to log in as normal and then start the process for posting. Now you notice, once it loads the page here, it's going to type in the link first. It's going to grab the image from this page. That's why you can't select an image down here to work with it. It's going to pull the image from this page URL. Then it's going to remove that URL from the post area and post your message that you want to have posted. I'm going to go ahead and stop it right here. And we'll see that when you hover this it's clickable so when I click it it goes straight through to that link that I used let's go ahead and delete this the other thing that's been added is the delete project button is no longer underneath the bump settings here and we've added a continuous bump now what this will do when checked it will continually loop back to the beginning of the list of of your posts and continue bumping along. So you can set this and forget it, hit start for bumping and it'll just continually keep bumping your posts uh, using your settings here for the delays uh, and your batch settings as well. The delete button for projects has been moved underneath the manager here. Hit the delete project by name and then you select it from the drop down which project you want to delete and then hit OK. It'll go ahead and delete that project for you. The other change that's been made was to the Facebook Niche Group Builder. And underneath Join, we've added batch settings. So now you can load up a large list of groups, how many you want to join before delaying the long delay in hours. And then, of course, you've got your Minimax wait time in between each join as well. We've also added the same username password options for proxies as what you've seen previously for the Social Elite software. And that's used under the Join and the Find section. Hope this video has helped you. If you as always, if you have any questions, just let us know and I will be happy to answer them for you. Thank you.